Your AL News starts now. Well, good morning, church family. Hello. We are so excited to be back for AL News. Yay! And there's so much starting up in the next couple weeks, so mm-hmm. I need you to pay attention. Yes. Are you paying attention? She's using her teacher voice, so. Eyes up here, everyone. Hello. <laughs> okay, I think they're oh, ready. Okay. So, <laughs> speaking of paying attention, mm-hmm. does something seem weird? Off? I'm not right? Not, I, not that I n- notice. Is it okay for you? I, I think so. <sighs> oh my. It's so embarrassing. We have forgotten how to do this. <sighs> Take two? Yes. Be right back. Hold on. <laughs> no. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Um. Take two. Here's hoping. <laughs> This Wednesday, August 31st, the youth will be having their fall kickoff event from 6.30 until 8 p.m. Yes. We're going to be welcoming our new members with ice cream. Ooh. Of course. (laughs) We're going to be dreaming about what this new year holds, Mm. and we have some very exciting and potentially very messy games. Mm. So, youth, mark it down. You don't want to miss it. And don't dress up. Please. (laughs) Don't. (laughs) Also, August 31st is the deadline for early registration for the women's retreat that's being held at Inspiration Hills in Inwood, Iowa. In Inwood. Mm -hmm. On October 7th through 9th. And if you sign up early, you can save $25. So why not? Why not? Oh, and you know what I heard? What? That if we have Kim and Anita there, there will be a lot of belly dancing. Really? I think so. Oh, belly laughter. Oh, that Sorry. sounds better. But yeah. hey, it'd be good exercise. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I do I do feel sad about the women's retreat though. Oh, can't you go? Oh I I can. It's just they're giving up. They're giving up what? Their time? No. The women. <sighs> they're Retreating. Oh, honey, it's <laughs> not that kind of retreat. This is a time where women are going to withdraw for a couple of days okay. to get together, to get refreshed and energized, and then you come back. Oh, and so it will be a great time to connect with other women in the church and grow deeper in growing in grace. Oh, so you're not, we're not giving up. No, we're not. Oh, good. No. Are you signed up? I am signed up. Me too. Yeah. And if you want to sign up, you can sign up on the app, the website, or turn in your insert in the bulletin with your payment Mm -hmm. to the church office. Yes. And bring your belly dancing costume. At least one. Maybe one to share. Yes. (laughs) Next Sunday, September 4th, we're having a baptism service. So anyone interested in getting baptized can inquire. If you aren't familiar with submersion baptism, it looks a little like this. So that's not intimidating at all. No, it's a ton of fun. <laughs> so if you're feeling led by the Holy Spirit to get baptized, you can contact Pastor Joe to receive more information. And we are very thankful for the faithfulness of our church family who continue to support Abundant Life financially. Mm-hmm. So if you're interested in helping support Abundant Life, there is a basket at the back of the sanctuary where you can place your tithes and offerings. Yeah. It's your, oh, is it my turn? <laughs> I'm still on. Wednesday. <laughs> wow. We're good. It, this is fine. It's been a while. September 7th. <laughs> things are going to be pretty exciting around oh, here. Oh, absolutely. We have officially, we will, on September 7th, officially start our fall program. Yay! <laughs> Beginning at 6.30, we have Kids Club for children. Kindergarten through fifth grade, mm-hmm. downstairs in kids camp, Sozo Youth for kids in sixth through twelfth grade in the youth room, mm-hmm. and Kingdom Living in room 110 for the old people. I mean, for the adults. 
and nursery. There's nursery for the babies for six months and preschool and in between. And technically, you're an old people. <laughs> so there's something for everyone. Exactly. <laughs> also, starting up September 7th is Sozo After School. Oh, yes. For the young people. For the young people. Like, like us. us. <laughs> From 4 till 6.30. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yes. Every Wednesday, you're invited to hang out downstairs yes. here at the church. We have snacks mm -hmm. and can help with homework, have yeah. quiet time, games and activities, and a delicious home-cooked meal. Yes. That we don't cook. That's why it's Even delicious. Better. <laughs> so youth, we hope you consider hanging out with us at Sozo After School whenever it works for your schedule this year. Yeah, this is my favorite time of year. Mm. I'm so excited to start Wednesday nights up again. Mm -hmm. I agree. And if you're new to our church family or just wanting to get more involved, mm -hmm. Wednesdays are a great opportunity for the whole family to get plugged in, yeah. to meet people, yeah. to grow spiritually. It's like a win-win-win. Oh, what's better? <laughs> Oh, I have one final announcement. Okay. Um, if you are interested in joining the Monday Night Trios Bowling League, an informational meeting will be held tomorrow, 6.30 at the Lanes Bowling Alley. Okay. So if you want more information, you can talk to our bowling rep, Pastor Jill. Sounds great. Mm -hmm. But what night is it being held? Mondays. Mondays. Okay. Yep. And how many are going to be on the team? Elaine, it's, it's the Monday Night Trios Bowling League. Right, so how many? Three. Three. Mm -hmm. That wasn't hard. Now, in case you can't remember everything we said today, or maybe you fell asleep during these announcements. Who could fall asleep during these announcements? We are very entertaining. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> Not good, but we're entertaining. <laughs> Uh, where was I? Oh, if you can't remember these things, you can find them in the church bulletin or on the events tab on the mm -hmm. AL app or website. And if you haven't downloaded the AL app yet, you simply need to. Mm -hmm. It will elevate your life in ways you can't imagine. Oh, yeah, it will. Well, that's it for this week. Good. <laughs> Have an awesome Sunday. Wow. That was pretty rough. That was rough. It's been a while. So, what do you think for next week? Maybe we call in for help? Find someone who knows what they're doing? I think we need some help. Do you have any ideas? Oh, I do. I know someone. I'll text them. This has been AL News.